Local educators are hard at work keeping students' brains active now that school is out. Aaron Stuvey has more about summer activities for kids around the community. School is out, and that has left many kids with a void to fill over the next few months. So local communities are filling their calendars with activities to keep kids busy until they return to school. On Tuesday, the Children's Museum of Southern Minnesota kicked off two programs, their annual Butterfly House and the first of their summer camps. The Butterfly House has been running for the past four summers and walks kids through the life cycle of monarch butterflies, from holding the caterpillars in their hands to watching them grow and change. Really the message we try to get across is First and foremost, play is important, so incorporating any sort of concept of play with the children, so allowing them to um, interact one-on-one -on -one and directly with the caterpillars is a big thing. Meanwhile, the Blue Earth County Library System partnered with the University of Minnesota's Raptor Center to tour the area with birds of prey. The lesson started in Sibley Park in Mankato before traveling to the Lake Crystal and Mapleton libraries to teach kids about birds of prey and the role they play in the natural ecosystem. Program coordinators say that that the summer months are crucial times to keep kids active rather than sitting dormant until the school year returns. A summer is a great time for children to be involved with camps that can help give them opportunities to do things that they maybe typically wouldn't be able to do in school, kind of expand on their learning a little bit more. Aaron Stuvey, KEYC News Now.